Hi everyone, it's Milena from BumperLeads.com. I'm one of the automation experts here at BumperLeads, focused on helping coaches, consultants, and e-commerce businesses bump up their inquiry, sales, and profit. And in today's video, I want to show you how you can send a one-off campaign to just one contact in your list. So the way I like to approach this is I like to use automations. So let's start there, click on automations and let's pretend to create a new automation, create an automation button just at the right uh, top corner. Let's start from scratch. And we're going to start this automation without a trigger. So if you look all the way down, there's an option start without a trigger. I like to start my automations with a wait period. So I'm going to make it five minutes, let's say. I normally start with a wait period of five minutes. And before we proceed building the automation, let's just give it a name. One off campaign to one contact. Just so we know what's it about. And I'm going to hit plus sign so I can build my automation. Send an email, create an email. Now I want to resend an existing campaign one of campaign. So I want to uh, send the same campaign I sent last week, let's say, but to one contact only. So the tab I want to look at here is past campaigns. This is the typical screen you'll see when you open um, campaigns inside active campaign. So let's just click on past campaigns. I want to send uh, maybe this one here, use this template because that's been sent already. Uh, welcome to my newsletter. Everything else should be the same here. I'm not going to change anything. And let's just go next. And let's go next or finish, sorry click on finish and let's save that and this is a very simple um, automation if you will so click on the plus sign and then let's end this automation so before we can add a contact to this automation we'll have to act, make this automation active so hit on the active button top right corner then what I normally do is I hit, uh, just click on the automation name. You can highlight that. Then control C, I use control C to copy or just copy it. And the next thing I want to do is find my contact that I want to send it to. So let's just find that person. It's going to be me. Okay, so as you can see, there's a lot of fields on this screen. So what I like to do is also just hide empty fields and then we can have a better view of this screen. Uh, and then I, what I do is just hit add next to automations. I can search for the automation, but uh, since I already copied it, I do control V. It's already there. Don't have to look for it and hit OK. And I'm going to just go back to automations to see how that all looks. I should be in there. Yep, this is me. And basically that's it. Now, if you want, you can build more things here inside the active campaign, oh, sorry, inside the automation. I can click on the plus sign here to say only send it, um, only send it on Tuesday current day of the week is Tuesday. There we go. So it's going to wait until it's Tuesday and then send me the campaign. So this is how you can send a um, campaign or resend the campaign to one contact in your list. Thank you for watching this video. If you've enjoyed it, please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can keep track of more valuable content from us. And if you need help with active campaign, uh, if you need someone to audit your active campaign setup, you can schedule a call with us, with one of our awesome team members at bumperleads.com slash grow, as in grow my business. 
and we'll be happy to assist you. Thanks again for watching and keep an eye out for the next video.